About 2,000 years ago, God sent an angel named Gabriel to a city in Galilee named Nazareth to a virgin who was betrothed to a man named Joseph of the house of David. This is a descendant of King David. That virgin's name was Mary. And having come in, the angel said to her, Rejoice, highly favored one, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you among women. And the Bible says, When she saw him, she was troubled at his saying, and considered what manner of greeting this was. That seems confusing to me, so I'll just paraphrase. She was kind of scared because an angel just fell from the ceiling. <laughs> But that angel said to her, Mary, do not be afraid. You have found favor with God, and behold, you will consume, consume, no, behold, you will conceive in your womb and bring forth a son, and you shall call this Son, Jesus. keeping watch over their flock by night. And behold, an angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them. And they were greatly afraid. But then the angel said to them, Do not be afraid, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which will be to all people. For there is born to you this day in the city of David a Savior, who is Christ the Lord. And this will be the sign to you. You will find a babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. thing that has come to pass, which the Lord has just now made known to us. And they came with haste, and they found Mary, Joseph, and the baby lying in a manger. And when they had seen him, they made widely known the saying which was told to them concerning this child. What child is this to lay to rest on Mary's lap is
the king, Behold, wise men from the east came to Jerusalem, saying, Where is he who is born king of the Jews? For we have seen his star in the east. We have come to worship him. Then Herod, when he had secretly called the wise men, determined from them what time the star appeared, and he sent them to Bethlehem and said, Go and search carefully for the young child. And when you found him, bring back word that I may come and worship him also. into the house they saw the young child with Mary his mother and they fell down and they worshipped him and when they had opened their treasures they presented gifts to him gold frankincense and myrrh So like the wise men and shepherds over 2,000 years ago, we pause to remember the child. Sleeping in the night and his eternal promise of goodness and light.
sense of kindness and compassion to others. We gather at celebrations. We create memories with families and friends. We go home. The coming of the holidays brings the promise of faith, of hope, and of love. As the Bible says, the greatest of these is love. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, endures all things. Love never ends. And so from age to age, from the mighty to the meek, from the young to the old, from the healthy and the sick, for the rich and the poor. For all nations, great or small, we rejoice in this season of love with one another, with merry greetings, with gracious gifts, and with glorious song. Special guest narrator, Chris Pratt. Thank you so much. Ladies and gentlemen, it was really my honor to share this beautiful candlelight ceremony with all of you. It's been a very special and an inspiring night. Um, for me, being a parent has really changed my life in, in so many ways. And, and one of those ways is to understand truly the love that a father can have for a child. And when I stare at this precious little creation of mine here, and I watch the ways in which he tries to please me, I just feel a love that is, that is so pure and unending. And the way we love our children 
And the more we love our children, the more we will understand the capacity for our Father in Heaven to love us. Each and every one of us, a precious creation, and He just marvels in the ways in which we can try to please Him. That should give us all a great deal of comfort. I know it does for me. This holiday season, let us embrace every one of our tomorrows with hope and love. And through this holiday spirit, may we continue to spread peace and goodwill throughout the world. Thank you, and Merry Christmas! <laughs>